Thank you for watching this short video on the tenancy law changes in Queensland on rent increases starting from 1 July 2023. On the 18th of April 2023, Queensland Parliament passed legislation to limit rent increases to no more than once every 12 months, and this applies to all tenancies. The Queensland Government took immediate action to address community concerns on the impacts of current market conditions and cost of living pressures on Queensland's households. These amendments bring Queensland into line with other Australian jurisdictions and balances the rights and interests of Queenslanders who rent and property owners and investors to maintain rental supply. The changes do not limit the rent increase amount. And remember, Queensland's rental laws have existing provisions that govern rents, including advertising rental properties at a fixed price and prohibiting rent auctions, limiting the amount of rent in advance and allowing renters to dispute excessive rent increases. Currently, the Residential Tenancies and Roomy Accommodation Act allows rent increases not less than six months. As of 1 July 2023, the rent increase is not to be less than 12 months. This will apply to existing and new tenancies from 1 July 2023. The 12 month minimum period applies where at least one tenant's right to occupy the rental property continues and whether or not there has been a change of property owner or managing agent. To help understand these new laws, let's have a look at some scenarios. This applies to all types of tenancies, general tenancies as well as rooming. So let's have a look at our first scenario. A tenancy agreement started the 15th of February 2023 and the tenants are continuing. Rent is scheduled to be increased with a new or renewal agreement on the 15th of August 2023. The rent increase is ineffective. The rent increase cannot occur until the 15th of February 2024. Let's look at our next scenario. An existing agreement is in place and started in September 2022. The rent increase is scheduled for September 2023. This increase is effective as it's not less than the 12 months. Our next scenario, a 12 month agreement started on the 10th of April 2023. This agreement has a special clause stating that the rent will be increased and will be due on the 10th of October 2023. This increase is ineffective. The increase cannot occur until the 10th of April 2024. Our next scenario, a six month tenancy ends on the 20th of July 2023. All tenants are vacating and new tenants will be moving in. The question is, can I increase the rent now or do I have to wait until July 2024? The answer is yes, you can increase the rent for the new tenancy as there are no tenants from the existing agreement renewing and they are all leaving. And finally, our last scenario, a new 12 month agreement starting on the 3rd of July 2023 with a proposed increase during the fixed term tenancy for the 3rd of January 2024. The rent increase is ineffective. Rent will not be able to be increased until the 3rd of July 2024. With these amendments from 1 July 2023, a tenant or resident is not required to pay a rent increase provided under a clause of an existing agreement unless at least 12 months has passed since the last rent increase, all the rent became payable. As mentioned earlier, under the Act, if a tenant feels the proposed rent increase is excessive, they can make an application to the Queensland Civil and Administrative Tribunal for an order. There is a process to follow and timeframes do apply. You can find out more information on this on the RTA's website, rta.qld.gov.au. An adjudicator at QCAT, when making a decision, may consider the range of market rents usually charged for comparable properties. The proposed increase compared to current rent, state of repair and term of the tenancy, the period since the last rent increase, and anything else the tribunal may consider relevant. 
For information on the previous tenancy law changes on domestic and family violence provisions, the additional grounds to end a tenancy, framework to negotiate renting with a pet, repair orders and other amendments, please visit the RTA's website. The upcoming tenancy law changes on minimum housing standards will commence from 1 September 2023 for new tenancies and from 1 September 2024 for all tenancies. The RTA will have more information on this topic on our website, including events around Queensland, webinars, podcasts, fact sheets, and they'll be available soon. Recently, you may be aware of the announcement of Stage 2 of Queensland's rental reforms. The government has produced an options paper and is seeking feedback from the rental sector on five key legislative reform priorities. You can have your say by the 29th of May 2023. Please use the link on your screen to go to the Department of Communities, Housing and Digital Economies Stage 2 Rental Law Reform page. The RTA is here to help everyone involved in a tenancy and the Queensland's rental sector. You can find bond and tenancy information, educational resources, forms and a lot more on the RTA's website at rta.qld.gov.au or contact our friendly staff in our contact centre on 1300 366 311.